Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about tips on how solving word problems of differential equations. Now, differential equations, as you might imagine, especially with word problems, uh, can be, take a little bit to uh, solve, and setting it up is actually the hardest part. But here are some tips on uh, helping you set up the uh, word problem and uh, go from there. Now, as you know, with differential equations, there's going to be a lot of things involving change. And so whenever you uh, look at words or phrases involving rates of change, okay, what that's going to allow you to do is write terms in derivative notation. Now, some of those terms could allow you to write terms like dp, dt. There's a lot of changes over time, so dt at the denominator is going to be used a lot. dv, dt, things like that. Now, something else to consider would be if any initial conditions were given. Oftentimes, it could be at time 0, but it doesn't have to be time 0. It could be when t equals to 1, 2, depends on what the situation is. Something else to look for would be if you're given a function to play with. Now, if function is not given inside the context of the problem, it may give you enough information to be able to look it up either earlier in the section or earlier in the book. And hopefully all, after all this stuff, it'll allow you to finally set up the either the integral or the differential equation to help you set up the integral. So it all depends on what kind of information that you're given, but basically look for any change terms that allow you to set up derivative notation, any initial conditions, any functions that be given would be great, and that'll allow you to eventually uh, get the integral. So I'm Jimmy Chang, and there are a few tips on, on how to solve word problems in differential equations.